having that emotion's good, but like definitely not like seesaw up and down. You've got to have good people around you um, because when something shit happens, there's going to be someone that's upbeat and there's going to be people that are down about it. And you know, we've got a team and it's definitely not one person that's always upbeat about everything. It's, it's, it switches off and having those people around you is, is massive. But I think it's, that's part and part of our, of our personalities. It's like a little bit of, it's whatever, like something shit happened today. It's fine because tomorrow something's different is going to happen. Um, and just knowing that and understanding that, I think, I think it's big. Don't let the highs like get too big and like don't let the lows like kind of get you, get you too low. Like, Having that emotion's good, but like definitely not like seesaw up and down. Just try and stay like as like level-headed as possible. I think definitely definitely helps. Definitely, and and if really bad things keep happening in your company, then it's a time where like you look at it and you're like, okay, maybe we need to fundamentally change something within the team, the company, the whatever. And having again like not just ignoring everything and just keep in your head against a brick wall actually taking a step back and being like okay like we should actually change something um i think that's also a good but just be honest with yourself you know like we are every every day like we're like did this work like we want it to work but did it work no all right sack it like forget about it and i think having that intuition helps massively